hello 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 everyone welcome back to the channel this is shane with the nut house coming to you on a chilly wednesday so i went and picked something up today and well i mean you've seen the thumbnail so you already know what it is but i'm pretty excited about it i have never purchased a trailer hitch this expensive before but you know it's one of those you know last trailer hitches you buy type thing um supposedly so here is what we've got oh there it is I'm trying to get it out of the truck but for some of you power stroke guys that have the three inch receivers this is the one we picked up um the, the ts 349b and i will link it in the description below but anyways so this is the um the model 10 whatever but it's a seven and a half inch drop seven inch rise and this has got the three balls on it so we have the three different towing options we got the one and seven eighths for the old school trailers we got the two inch for probably your smaller uh utility trailers and then some of your bigger trailers at two and five sixteenths so um we got that picked up today we also picked up the um what's it called a uh, bolt lock or whatever it is for the for the pin that uh, that goes with a key so let me get that out we'll get it set on the tailgate i'll be right back all right take two all right so anyways i don't know what what just happened my um camera thing here started acting goofy but anyways here's the bolt lock we got um here's the model number again i'll have it linked down below um but anyways this is the one that you use your key with um and for me you know i've got this style of key you oh, you pull it apart and you've got this you stick it in there boom turn it and and now it's actually key to your truck so you know if you lose your truck key well then you can't well then you're screwed because you've lost your truck key so anyways the moment we've all been waiting for La. no just kidding no 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 singing but anyways here it is man this thing is massive as you can see I'm trying to get it with one hand oh. Oh. here it is so we've got the big three inch shank um, and this is only uh, for the Power Stroke Super Duties with the three inch. If you got the seven three, um, I think they, I believe they only come with a two and a half. So if you wanted the larger shank, you actually have to step up um, to actually getting yourself a Power Stroke. Um, which if you're getting a Super Duty and you're not getting a Power Stroke, well then, never mind. I won't go there. Anyways, so, oh by the way, what do you think? Not bad. 30 days in officially as of yesterday 30 days into my year and we are growing this thing out in a competition to see if we can win 10 g's and then we'll take a really cool vacation and we'll take you guys along with us so here it is so again we got the bmw um not not bmw b and w three inch shank three ball setup let's go ahead and get this thing put in the truck so set all this stuff to the side hit this big oh dang i don't want to drop it it's so pretty man it is cold out here it's well it's it's cold for us texas guys it's like below 30 degrees and uh that's that's pretty chilly i try to prop y'all There we go, got y'all propped up. Yeah. What's up? So, as you can see here, the way it comes, it comes with one here already, and this is the two and a, two and a half inch receiver hitch, and then I bought a sleeve to get me down to the two inch, which is what fits my old truck. And now you can see, oh, my wife's leaving. Now you can see this big, massive hitch here. So what we're gonna do is, uh, well, I'm gonna have to put you down again because I won't be able to do both at the same time. Oh, good Lord. <laughs> All right, there we have it. Look how good that looks. It 
it looks so much bigger on the truck than it did inside the box inside the box i was like man i think i screwed up but this is the biggest drop that uh, that they offer for a three inch uh hitch so we tow we tow a few different things we don't tow anything massive but i do plan on getting a travel trailer soon and i wanted to make sure i got me a good enough hitch and if i do decide to put a lift on the truck which may or may not happen more than likely probably just a level with uh, a little bit bigger tires well i mean snowflake over there's got 37s mr earl here's only got the factory 35 so you know we can't let old school beat new school right so anyways let's uh let's drop this down let's see if we can figure out how to key this lock come on slow tailgate all right let's do this let you guys blow over pin the lock I have directions on how to use tear off lock seal where's the lock seal oh there it is lock seal tear off lock seal and uh, I'm a nail biter so I've got zero fingernails oh spider co tenacious fantastic knife for anyone who's uh, looking for a good knife you'll probably see this one mostly in my videos that I'm using and uh, sure why not I'll put that down in the description below as well all right so I tear that off I gotta break off this other seal here it's got a little rubber seal and we'll take that off and then it says my goodness insert the key Let's see here, rotate, maybe it only goes in one way. There it goes, so insert the key fully, and then we're gonna rotate this clockwise until it stops. That must, that must be it. Well, that was pretty easy. See, I don't know if you can see it in there or not. See it rotating in there. So let's uh, let's go ahead and let's try to get this put on here. Oh, sit down on the ground here, man. I don't know. Have I told y'all it is freaking chilly out here? Wind is blowing. You know, all that good stuff. So let's go ahead and get that put through there. Man, I hope that's enough room. Sure doesn't look like it. I may have to go back and get a different. I may have to go back and get a different one. But that's going to be terrible because now this thing is considered used, right? I think I got it. You just gotta be smarter than the pin. It looks like it, you know, it sits in there pretty, pretty far. I mean, it goes all the way to the curve. And then that's not coming off. We'll put the cap on it. And there we have it. Installed the BMW hitch, three inch. And uh, well, let's go ahead and show you guys how it works. So you pull your pins, boom, one there. Yes, I'm sitting on the ground. One there. And then, well, I'm going to set you guys. See if I can set you guys up somewhere. Anyways, maybe I'll just do this. Hopefully, you can see this. Pull one pin, set it down. Pull pin number two. And now 
even if they even if they steal your pins this thing is locked in place it's not going anywhere only way to get it off is if this thing is completely out of, up here and then you can pull it all the way through but that's where we're looking and then you pull this pin let me put one of these other pins in real quick all right just for demonstration purposes we just got one pin in now you pull this pin out oh, like that you know what my helper's here i'm gonna let her hold the camera and you guys can hear me here we go all right so we pulled that we pulled the pin out of this side and then we're gonna we can pull this one out and this allows this to rotate 360 degrees there's your one and seven eighths you got your two inch ball here and then you've got your two and five sixteenths here so what we'll do is we're going to leave it right here on the on the one inch because oh back here because what we're going to do or the one and seven eighths because what we're going to do is when we flip it and it goes upside down then everything kind of tucks in and away so then we pull this pin here and then again it's trapped nobody can steal your stuff which is pretty awesome then we slide this thing up and see how it's nice tucked away and uh that way you don't have to worry about it hanging down and catching on anything you know what you got so and then you put your pins back in here there's one there is two so you got your pins in kind of rotate those and again that is locked in there you grab your truck key stick it in boom and now it's unlocked you can pull your pin out and you can change hitches you can flip it over so you've got a rise if for whatever reason your truck is is short put it on there that joker's locked in place and nobody is still in that lock well unless they cut it off but then at that point you know what's the point on having the lock so guys i hadn't said it in this video please like and subscribe make sure you hit that like button we are super stoked we are at a thousand and sixty subscribers that's right one zero six zero subscribers super excited i appreciate all you guys that have hung out with us that have been there supported us um, friends and family alike and uh guys we just want to keep going keep going keep going like i said i'll have the links in the description down below uh to our amazon account where if you click on it and you buy something from their page we get a small commission that helps us build and do things to old earl here earl or mr snowflake down there oh brooklyn's in the way or mr snowflake over there that just helps us you know kind of do more builds and do more stuff you know around the house you know maybe some more product videos or whatever the case may be so we do have some stuff here at the house uh wiring wise for the truck we've got some running board lights um and then we've got the raptor lights we've got those in i checked them out they look great it's just been too busy around here as some of you know we are in the process of getting our house ready to sell and we are moving and so that takes most of our time in the evenings and just throwing a hitch on real quick um, with you guys coming along with us doing that is a is a pretty quick turnaround so again guys really appreciate y'all watching i'm going inside now where it is a lot warmer see you guys next time love y'all